Like, what is expertise? What does it mean? Uh, let me ask a question right here. Of all you students, uh, is there anyone here that does not want to be an expert in your field? I, I was hoping that there would be somebody that would, would say they didn't. Because the fact you didn't raise your hand means that everybody here do, does want to be an expert, okay? So what is an expert? I mean, so I got my cheat sheet with me here. Don't go through the 17 points. Don't do it. <laughs> no, because I think it's important that as, as we go through the evening. I understand. I get it. That we, uh, with all the stories, that we can continually um, have them um, lead back to try, each of us trying to understand in our own mind what an ex expert is. Okay. If we're going to get there, if we want to get there, what, what is it that we're trying to achieve, right? So I don't know what an expert is. So I'm, helping that, I'm hoping that by the end of the night, I, I've got a, uh, more of an opinion on it. An expert is somebody that's got extensive knowledge, right? Can't argue with that. Experience? I don't know. I know a lot of people with a lot of experience that uh, aren't any better for it, but, but as far as I can tell. An expert needs to have a track record of some type, a successful track record, I should say. He's got to have some kind of stature in his field. Um, ability to think and act independently and creatively. He's got to be resourceful. He should have contacts and relationships in his field. It's nice if he's open-mindedness. He's Non-arrogance is always good. Uh, Team-oriented. Willing to accept responsibility, willing to assume authority, good instincts. You got to have an understanding of nuances and relationships. And I think you got to have a little bit of um, professional courage and you got to have some ethics, you know. 